What's going on guys? Today we're going to be talking about cleaning SOPs and the difference between cleaning the low templates solventless system, the Osprey, and the mesclatory solventless. Cleaning a machine is incredibly important from a sanitary perspective, but it's also very important from an operating perspective. And I don't see a lot of videos or information in general on how to clean any of the large automated solventless machines out on the market. And so we decided to really take a deep dive into the difference between our system and how a competitor might operate. So you can clearly see just how cumbersome it can be to clean some of these uh, machines. So why are we scooping out the flour instead of draining it then? So the reason you want to scoop out the flour, um, this is our last pull. So um, once we drain, this is for the final time and then it's us in the cleanup. So the reason you want to scoop all your biomass out on the last pull is so that there isn't any chance that as you're draining for the trim to clog up the uh, drain port and potentially uh, end up having hash kind of caught up in all this spent biomass. So this is just a good way to kind of prevent that from happening and keep your yields uh, closer to where you want them to be, as well as it makes the final uh, clean out easier. Because what I'll do is once this is uh, scooped out and I've gotten it all drained, I'll actually remove the agitator plate and hose it all out through the filter bag so that way I'm not missing any bit of hash with this uh, final drain. And then uh, just doing this, it makes the final bit a bit easier, not leaning into the vessel trying to scoop the biomass out. But you're also not like trying to work it all down the drain and then making your uh, 220 bag incredibly heavy. So this just kind of adds and helps with the cleanup and make sure you get all the hash for your very last pull. So anything that may have just been caught up in the trim from previous pulls should come out on this one and we should keep any transfer loss to a minimum. The Osprey is one of the easier machines to clean but the ergonomics are just terrible where you have to be bending over on a step ladder to reach into a tank in a cold, potentially wet room. The Mesclatore, on the other hand, has a bag system making cleanup very straightforward and easy. Our bags have handles in the corners and these are made to connect a shop hoist to. So what you would do is take your trolley out to your cleanup area, connect the hoist and hoist the bag out. This enables a one person cleanup operation. Our newer bags do not have a rigid outer support structure and they have a zipper on the bottom, making emptying a hanging bag very easy. As you can see, the thermoplastics prevent hash from sticking to the walls and a little rinsing is all that's necessary to remove any residue. 